Hey folks, Kiwi here, and welcome back to another episode of, uh, Minecraft Story Mode. Had to stop for a second, I almost said, you modded Minecraft, because anytime I start any video, that's the only intro that gets me, because phonetically it's so well done. It just rolls off the tongue. And that's gonna mess me up for every series forever. We've got a city to save. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Yeah, I'll let you have that honor. Oh, and Jesse, I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. Well, why the hell wouldn't I? Also, it's raining, which is... I wouldn't call ideal. Oh, well, oh, okay, I'm much faster than you. I'm just gonna... just gonna... Whoa! <laughs> she started. She got the quick head start, but I like how it's doing this even when I'm not. That's awesome and hilarious. Well, we need to get in there now. Go, go, go! Don't stop! Look out! Whoa! No way back. Everything that I expected them to have done. I want Aiden to actually die, and also what's her chick that is friends with him. But Gil is cool. Okay, let's do it. You you demonstrated that you're some pretty cool fighter chick. Yeah, do stuff like that. City is under attack by monsters now. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden, come on. We need to stop him. It's like the worst I'm kind sorry, of griefers. But I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you. Yeah, it makes sense. You go fucking you do you, you know? Jess, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo! I keep hitting E instead of Q. It's some sort of bizarre reflex from one of the games I've played in the past. You are very quick on your feet. Thank you, I, I earned that. How are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Don't worry about it. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land! You speak truthfully, my friend? Yeah, just jump and then hit the water, you know, you everyone will be fine. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. See you on the other side. Just don't die by sticking that sword in your head like you just did. <laughs> don't do that thing you just did. What assholes? Yep. Don't focus on me though, focus on the on the gas there. You know, iron blocks have very good, uh, resistance. Oh, hey. Hey. Hey, man. Aiden is taking over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We Can't we just run up the him. steps to him? I know. Jesse, take one of these. What do they do? They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any portions of invisibility? Here. Does it take the armor as well? I like how it's invisible for everyone but us, but... Oh, okay, you just hold forward. Okay, I'm not gonna punch them. Ah, I see. Back down and get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the founder! Yeah? No. Well, oh, God, my eyes are... You don't shut up! Now you listen here! I'm the... This is between you and me, Aiden. Leave Reginald out of it. I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! He's the founder with you! <laughs> oh god, this is the worst time. I left I right eyeball. Can you not please? I killed you. Hold on, I'm very sorry guys. Holy shit. Oh god. 
God, my eye is incredibly itchy right now. I'm going to pause the video because this will be bothering me until I fix it. Okay, it should be good. All right, where were we? Once, I could do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Yep. Just die already! No, fuck you. Should have left while you had the chance! <laughs> Blaze rods, I get it. Ah, cute. Uh, technically, you, you ruined it. Why couldn't you have left well enough alone? Because you're a piece of shit, you idiot. I will stab you in the throat and also the other places as well. Get back here! He's gonna jump off the edge or something. Oh, the rain killed it. Nice. I can't even hold shift to go faster. Oh, he's building off. To where? Is it just a battle arena? The punishment for death is just you fall. Like, we already know what happens when that happens. He doesn't, but we do. You can't stand to see someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Apparently, you're that. It just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right. You're projecting, that dude. That is why you're gonna lose. You're projecting. You're tired of other people winning when you can't. And so you, uh, you want other people to fail. Ah, uh, two. Stop hitting E. He's, uh, he's gotten quite good at moves. I mean, he, he telegraphs a little bit, but hey, you know, no big deal. I will fucking obliterate you, dude. Uh, Lucas, be, don't be hit by that. He tries anything while I do this. Okay, he didn't. You did it. Just oh, he's gonna try something now. He's gonna push me off again. Please, this place is getting worse by the minute. You can't just leave me here. Take me with you. After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 no! Come on! You can't just leave me behind. Send him away. If you leave me here, I'll die. I thought you were the good guys. Hmm. That's a very good point. What does send him away mean? That was far more violent than I expected. <laughs> oh, I am not healthy mentally. Well, that's not good. This place is in ruins. Where's that punk Aiden? I ditched him. Holy badass! You retrieved the ever source. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together. Jesse, there you are. Jesse, 
the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters and protect my people. The longer we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. We need to get out of here. The waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? And then I jumped. Spacebar to jump. Except not really. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna swim. Come on everyone, just just swim with me. I'm gonna put my hands behind my head and relax. And the founder too. Alright everyone. <laughs> they pushed them, that's funny. Guys, your city is kind of gone forever. Let's, uh... Let's find everyone safe at the bottom. Oh, did we fall until it was morning? You are alive. There's ground everywhere. <laughs> There's ground everywhere. <laughs> I cannot thank you enough. You've saved us all. Yeah, well, don't worry about it. What do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. Eh, just take it slow. Take it slow, okay? You guys have been isolated for so long. You don't want to get overwhelmed by all this real world. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what happened to Aiden. Hey, guards. Check out what washed up right next to me. Okay, so the sword didn't uh, fall in your head. You're not going anywhere. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. Knew they wouldn't get away. Yeah, they deserve this. What goes around comes around. Am I right, guys? <laughs> Come up and. Yeah. Good luck finding me, bro. Attention! Attention! Hello, hello everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow, those two just cannot get along. Jesse, Pick neither side. I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna sure pick neither side. Because like I like them both, so. What? Hey, both of you! Fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win! <laughs> oh, well, of course you'd think that way. <laughs> what? No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. But that's we true. We must trust in ourselves. Be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build. W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Of course the people can build, but we need a system, some rules. Rules aren't bad. Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan. But you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things. But you got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you. Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. <laughs> well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. Yeah, it's gonna be Ground City, and then they destroy the ground. It'll be Sky City again. But It'll I be a re for recursive cycle. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. Just try and play nice with the founder, okay? I know you don't always get along, but... 
Her heart's in the right place. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... Yeah, she's a fucking badass. She's alright. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Mm -hmm. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, come on, Ivor. It could be fun. <laughs> you shouldn't worry so much. I've got our way home all figured out. Yeah, bro. I we're gonna start our own skyblock. I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Shut yeah. up. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. <laughs> yeah. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come but on. it actually didn't present itself. <laughs> oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. Oh, her. It's okay. It looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? <laughs> what are you going to do now? Besides, continue <laughs> to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yeah, take your pets. A rather nice note. Don't let your pet How die to, to a wither some storm. Of those, um, very tall vertical rocks. We call them mountains, usually. Lovely. <laughs> After so long, fucking being right. The founder and the ever source. Now we can just be Isa and her best friend. Benedict. Ah, Benedict. That's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. <laughs> Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. It's pretty cool. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of <laughs> Benedict, adventures ahead of us. The adventure oh, chicken. There goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hmm. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Yeah. Jesse. I was just thinking that I'm glad the founder and Benedict have each other. Yeah, that is nice. Yes, yes. Very heartwarming. Shut the fuck up, okay? I'm missing my pig. See? Just like I told you. One portal back home. Sweet. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Why not? Oh, is someone being grumpy? There's no. so much fan fiction that could be read that could be wrote about this. Just hoping for a real treasure is all. Come on now. <laughs> Loy stocks no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Hmm. Come on, guys. Let's go home. That's actually a good point. What would happen? <laughs> Would it start becoming the Eversource then, or? Axel and Olivia hear where we've been. They'll never believe. Um. That's not what I was expecting. Oh. So fan fictions. <laughs> Fresh. Come on. Oh, no. No. That's what you did to the last game. Damn it. <sighs> Fucking hell. Alright, well sorry guys for being so quiet this entire time. I've been I'm very tired. It is kind of 3 30 in the morning. Um as for my thoughts on this game, let me turn on my webcam actually. Oh, that pauses the game. Oh, well then. Wait, wait, hold on. It's very blurry. Bleh. There we go. Hey. Hey guys, this is what I look like. So, uh, in regards to the game, I quite enjoyed it. It was incredibly, um, enjoyable, I guess. I don't know what other words to say. Um... I really liked the idea, like, they ended the game basically with episode 4 and they decided, let's have a sequel, essentially, but they, they sort of took this one sequel idea and, you know, brought it in, it's just like a, it's sort of like a movie, 
but this is the first act of the <clears throat> first act of the movie, or maybe a TV series after a first movie. Um, but honestly, it was really good. It has a lot of potential to go places, and I predict that there will be quite a lot of fan fiction for this game if you know how to, where to look, um, or if you care enough to look at all. Um, there's there is a lot you can do. The the sky block thing was really cool. Like, uh, I, I didn't expect the chicken at all. That was that was a little weird, but... Um, yeah, it was, it was basically based on a on a sky block. Like, you should check it out, uh, what a sky block is. But, uh, you start with minimalist resources and a tiny chunk of land. And you build out from there. You get a cobble gen, you get, you know, trees, you get other stuff. Sometimes there's other tiny islands infinite far away that you have to go to to get, like, diamond blocks or whatever, but... Uh, no, this was, this was really good. This was really uh, a lot of fun. Uh, sorry that uh, Axel and Olivia couldn't be on this journey. Unfortunately, they were, they were you know, cast out. They just they couldn't be in the game anymore. They're not in the sequel. That guy's not in the sequel. Uh, but what else? Um, I already said most of what I enjoyed. I basically talked at the end of every episode what I enjoyed. I guess my overall feeling for this game was that I really... I really liked it a lot, you know, it's it's Minecraft with a story, that's, uh, but I did enjoy playing Jessie as a character, she, uh, like, I never thought for a second that, that I was her, like, I did for, say, you know, Mass Effect, I didn't get involved in the character's, uh, persona, or into them, I always knew that I wasn't a part of them, um, so that's a good thing. That's Telltale does that right all the time. That's why when I started using my webcam, I decided then and there... I used my webcam for other videos, in case you didn't see. Um, I decided then and there that I wouldn't use it for, for this game. Because it sort of wrecks the immersion. Regardless of the fact that I'm talking over her and over the uh, other people, uh, I feel like just the idea that... Oh, thank you. Oh, and me. I, th I like the idea that, like, I'm a, just sort of uh, this tag-along voice, I guess, in her head or something. But, I don't know, it's just, it's, it's, it was just a really fun experience, and can't wait for the next Telltale game. Um, I'm probably going to do either Tales from the Borderlands or The Walking Dead, or The Wolf Among Us next. I might do The Wolf Among Us next. Um, not right away, it may take a few weeks to a month gonna play some other stuff in the meantime i got factorio and i got game dev, game dev tycoon for now uh but yeah so i'm i just really really enjoy this this is definitely up there uh it's not on the same level as life is strange because that one got me extremely emotionally invested and i cried for uh for a little bit at the end because it sort of hit me in the heart but, uh, sort of hit close to home there, but, uh, the death of Ruben was an interesting experience for me. Um, obviously it was sad, but, uh, a pet of mine ha have, has, have, has died in the, uh, in the last two years. And obviously that's, that's a while. I've, I've, I've gotten past the grieving point, but that was sort of, uh, like an actual, you know, that, that one I felt a little bit. Uh, lost my cat to actual, like, falling. Because I live in an apartment. You can't see it behind the, uh, the flag. But I live in an apartment building. Um, and she sort of fell out the window because she, she was going on her 18th year, my cat. And she has been falling off things a few times. And eventually, uh, one summer, two years ago, she fell off the windowsill, uh, and hit the ground. So... That was, that was bad. Anyway, I'm not going to get into that. Uh, I have a vlog up, if you want to go backwards in my channel, about that happening. But Anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for sticking through this uh, experience with me. Um, it means a lot that you did. I just... It was, uh, it was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed this game, and I can't wait for more Telltale stuff. Um, let's take a look at my choices, because you didn't see it for the last episode. Uh, here we go. Episode 4. Uh, you and 2.1 players crafted a diamond shovel. Well, I'm going to assume a lot of people went with the uh, with the hoe. Or the with the sword. 
Uh, your friends let Lucas save his friends. Yeah, yeah. Uh, hurried back to warn everyone. I forget what that one was about specifically. Um, eh, whatever. You and 84.6% of players chose new armor. Well, of course. I mean, Magnus' armor was cool and all, but I wanted to be known for my own thing, not for someone else's. Um, I kept his his, his armor as a, as a keepsake. You and 46.4% of players convinced Gabriel to keep the secret. I still regret that. Not gonna lie, that one was a little eh, on it. Uh, anyway, this'll this'll do it for me. Uh, oh, then there you go. Oh wait, no, I can see I can see what the decision was. Oh, okay, it was about the witch. Interesting that that was a decision. Right. Well, uh, yeah, this will be it for me. Um, thank you guys a lot for sticking with me through this through this adventure and its sequel and the fan fiction I will most likely never write. I, I write fan fiction, but not not for uh, not for this game. Anyway, <laughs> I don't know. I might. I have no idea. I, I'm not too interested in it. I do Portal and My Little Pony stuff, but that's about it. Um, yeah, I guess uh, I'm very much so rambling. If you haven't left the video already, uh, see you in the next series. Thank you.